Welcome to, Gargoyles. Then and now, where we delve into the world of animated fantasy and explore the voices behind the stone. Gargoyles, is an animated television series that aired from 1994 to 1997. It was created by Greg Weissman and produced by Walt Disney Television Animation. The show is known for its dark and mature themes, complex storytelling, and rich mythology. The premise of, Gargoyles, revolves around a group of gargoyles who are ancient creatures that turn to stone during the day and come to life at night. They originally protected a castle in medieval Scotland until a betrayal led to their curse. Join us as we journey through the past and present of the beloved series, discovering the actors who brought these iconic characters to life. First, we have Keith David, whose commanding voice breathed life into the noble leader of the gargoyles, Goliath. With his powerful presence and emotional depth, David's portrayal of Goliath captured the hearts of viewers and remains a cornerstone of the series. Keith David as Goliath. Born on June 4, 1956, in Harlem, New York, Keith David emerged as a titan of the entertainment industry. However, it was his portrayal of Goliath in the animated series, Gargoyles, that truly cemented his status as a legend. Keith David's journey to success was one marked by determination and passion for his craft. His resonant voice and versatile acting abilities allowed him to tackle a wide range of roles across film, television, and theater. Beyond, Gargoyles, Keith David's illustrious career boasts numerous successes. He has lent his voice to memorable characters in animated series such as, Spawn, and, The Princess and the Frog, while also delivering powerful performances in films like, Platoon, the Thing, and, There's Something About Mary. His ability to imbue characters with depth and emotion has earned him acclaim from critics and audiences alike. Throughout his career, Keith David's talents have been recognized with prestigious awards and nominations. He has earned multiple Daytime Emmy nominations for his voice work in animated series and a Tony Award nomination for his performance in the Broadway production of, Jelly's Last Jam. Keith David is alive and well his talent and presence continuing to enrich the world of entertainment. Jonathan Frakes as David Xanatos. Born on August 19, 1952, in Belfont, Pennsylvania, Jonathan Frakes emerged as a versatile talent in the world of entertainment. However, it was his portrayal of the cunning and enigmatic David Xanatos in the animated series, Gargoyles, that truly showcased his range as an actor. Jonathan Frake's journey to success was one marked by a relentless pursuit of excellence and a passion for storytelling. His role as Xanatos, the wealthy and manipulative businessman, allowed him to explore the depths of villainy while also bringing nuance and depth to the character. Frake's portrayal of Xanatos remains one of the standout performances of his career, earning him acclaim from fans and critics alike. Beyond, Gargoyles, Jonathan Frake's career boasts numerous achievements. He is best known for his role as William Riker in the beloved science fiction series, Star Trek, The Next Generation, where he became a fan favorite for his portrayal of the charismatic first officer. Frake's contributions to the Star Trek franchise extended beyond acting, as he also directed several episodes and feature films within the series. Throughout his career, Jonathan Frake's talents have been recognized with accolades and awards. He has earned multiple Saturn Award nominations for his performances in science fiction and fantasy roles, as well as critical acclaim for his work behind the camera as a director. However, it is his memorable portrayal of David Xanatos that remains etched in the minds of fans of Gargoyles. Jonathan Frakes is alive and well, his talent and presence continuing to enrich the world of entertainment. Marina Sirtis as Demona. Marina Sirtis, born on March 29, 1955, in London, England, emerged as a force to be reckoned with in the world of acting. However, it was her portrayal of Demona in the animated series, Gargoyles, that truly showcased her range as an actress. Marina Sirtis' journey to success was one marked by determination and a passion for her craft. Her role as Demona, the complex and conflicted gargoyle, allowed her to explore the depths of betrayal, redemption, and everything in between. Sirtis' portrayal of Demona remains one of the standout performances of her career, earning her acclaim from fans and critics alike. Beyond, Gargoyles, Marina Sirtis' career boasts numerous achievements. She is best known for her role as counselor Deanna Troy in the beloved science fiction series, Star Trek, The Next Generation, 
where she became a fan favorite for her portrayal of the empathic and compassionate counselor. Certis' contributions to the Star Trek franchise extended beyond acting, as she also appeared in several films and continued to be involved in various Star Trek projects. Throughout her career, Marina Certis' talents have been recognized with accolades and awards. She has earned multiple Saturn Award nominations for her performances in science fiction and fantasy roles, as well as critical acclaim for her work on stage and screen. Marina Sirtis is alive and well, her talent and presence continuing to enrich the world of entertainment. Sally Richardson as Elisa Maza. Born on November 23, 1967, in Chicago, Illinois, Sally Richardson embarked on a remarkable journey that would see her become a beloved figure in the world of animation and television. However, it was her portrayal of Elisa Maza in the animated series, Gargoyles, that truly showcased her range as an actress. Sally Richardson's path to success was one marked by determination and a passion for storytelling. Her role as Elisa Maza, the fearless and resourceful NYPD detective, allowed her to embody strength, courage, and compassion. Richardson's portrayal of Elisa resonated with audiences, earning her acclaim and admiration from fans of all ages. Beyond, Gargoyles, Sally Richardson's career boasts numerous achievements. She has appeared in a variety of television shows and films, showcasing her versatility as an actress. Richardson is perhaps best known for her roles in the science fiction series, Eureka, and the drama series, Being Mary Jane, where she earned critical acclaim for her performances. Throughout her career, Sally Richardson's talents have been recognized with accolades and nominations. She has earned multiple NAACP Image Award nominations for her performances, as well as praise for her work behind the camera as a director. However, it is her memorable portrayal of Elisa Maza that remains etched in the hearts of fans of Gargoyles. Sally Richardson is alive and well, her talent and presence continuing to enrich the world of entertainment. Jeff Bennett as Brooklyn Born on October 2, 1962, in Houston, Texas, Jeff Bennett emerged as a versatile talent in the world of voice acting. However, it was his portrayal of Brooklyn and Owen Burnett in the animated series, Gargoyles, that truly showcased his talent and versatility. Jeff Bennett's journey to success was one marked by dedication and a passion for his craft. His ability to seamlessly transition between characters allowed him to tackle a wide range of roles across animation, television, and film. As Brooklyn, the adventurous and impulsive gargoyle, and Owen Burnett, the loyal and enigmatic assistant to David Xanatos, Bennett brought depth and nuance to both characters, earning him acclaim from fans and critics alike. Beyond, gargoyles, Jeff Bennett's career boasts numerous achievements. He has lent his voice to countless animated series and films, becoming one of the most prolific and sought-after voice actors in the industry. Bennett's versatility as an actor has allowed him to portray a diverse array of characters, from heroes to villains and everything in between. Throughout his career, Jeff Bennett's talents have been recognized with accolades and nominations. He has earned multiple Annie Award nominations for his voice work, as well as praise for his performances in various animated series and films. Jeff Bennett is alive and well, his talent and presence continuing to enrich the world of entertainment. Bill Fogerbach as Broadway. Born on October 4, 1957, in Fontana, California, Bill Fogerbach emerged as a beloved figure in the world of animation and television. However, it was his portrayal of Broadway in the animated series, Gargoyles, that truly endeared him to fans around the world. Bill Fogerbach's journey to success was one marked by dedication and a passion for his craft. His role as Broadway, the gentle and kind-hearted gargoyle, allowed him to showcase his talent for bringing characters to life with authenticity and depth. Fogerbach's portrayal of Broadway resonated with audiences of all ages, earning him acclaim and admiration from fans. Beyond, gargoyles, Bill Fogerbach's career boasts numerous achievements. He is perhaps best known for his role as Patrick Starr in the animated series, SpongeBob SquarePants, where he became a fan favorite for his portrayal of the lovable but dim-witted starfish. Fogerbach's contributions to SpongeBob SquarePants have earned him widespread recognition and praise. Throughout his career, Bill Fogerbach's talents have been recognized with accolades and nominations. He has earned multiple Annie Award nominations for his voice work, as well as praise for his performances in various animated series and films.
Bill Fogerbach is alive and well, his talent and presence continuing to enrich the world of entertainment. As we celebrate their achievements and the timeless magic of gargoyles, we invite you to share your thoughts and memories in the comments below. Which character resonated with you the most? What are your favorite moments from the series? We'd love to hear from you. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more nostalgic content and updates. Thank you for joining us on this journey down memory lane. Together, let's keep the spirit of gargoyles alive and thriving for generations to come.